Whether you're playing a casual puzzle game or a more intense game with high graphics that you can only play on the most flagship of phones, what we're going to be doing is going over the best games available for Android. Now this can be a full list of our top 5 or it can just be one specific application, so let's take a look. Hey guys, Michael from Copper vs Glass and today we're going to be looking at an application that's been available for iOS for quite some time and has now made its way to Android and it is Crossy Road. It's basically an endless runner game with some great visuals and a bunch of characters to unlock, so let's take a look. Now the first thing that I want to get out of the way is the amount of characters that you can unlock in this game as it's kind of one of the main points. There's 70 characters in all and you can pay 58 pence for each individual character if you wish. Now you will actually unlock characters while playing throughout the game and I've got 7 out of 70 characters and haven't had to spend a penny. As for instance this character here, a poopy pigeon, I actually unlocked this character through playing the game and getting coins which I'll show you in just a second. So as you can see in the top right hand corner you've got the amount of coins that you've got and it costs about 100 coins to get a new character. Now in terms of playing the game it is also very simple. Now as you can see I am using the chicken character at the moment and the scene itself is the standard default scene that you're going to get. So you've got green grass, nice trees. But if you go into the character selection and select a different character, for instance like the kangaroo which I'm just going to get to now, the kangaroo obviously comes from Australia and it's going to reload the world to make it look just like Australia so it's a more desert theme. You've got some trees that don't really have any leaves on it or anything like that but playing the game is exactly the same. So all you do is you tap on the screen to move your character forwards and you can swipe left and right to go to different areas in terms of collecting coins or avoiding obstacles. So it's a very simple game and the premise itself is very simple but as you can see there's quite a lot of hazards that you need to avoid. You've got trains, a river and you've also got the cars as well. If you've played the original arcade game Frogger it's basically exactly the same as that. So as you can see there's a coin there to my left hand side so if I swipe over to the left I can collect that and it puts it up in the top right hand corner. Now the cool thing that I like about this is you can't stay in one place for too long as if you stay in one place unfortunately you get taken away by a bald eagle which means then that you need to restart again from scratch. Now it is a good game, there's not really a lot to it in terms of high scores. Because it is on the Google Play Store you can expect that a lot of people have hacked the game which is definitely a disappointment as there's not really a lot of challenge to it apart from personally with yourself. I would highly recommend it, it is completely free in the Play Store and it's something that I would kind of just pick up and play when I've got a spare couple of minutes. It's a great game, the visuals look good and one thing that I like as well is it does run on older hardware. I'm running it here on my Nexus 5 at the moment and you can also run it on something like a Moto G or even a Moto E as once you go to the next menu there is a settings button in the bottom left hand corner that allows you to turn off the shadows which increases the performance of the game drastically. Now as you can see here in terms of the actual coins I need to earn around 41 coins to get to 100 to unlock my next character and I'm going to get a free gift in around 2 minutes and 56 seconds. Now a free gift is usually coins, I've only actually got one character as a free gift in the time I've been playing it or you can watch a short video for around 20 or 30 seconds to also get a free gift. I'm going to put all the links in the description below so you can download this game for yourself and if you guys have got any questions or any games that you want us to have a look at here at Copper vs Glass be sure to leave that down in the comments section below. If you enjoyed this video be sure to hit the like button and if you want to see more great content from Copper vs Glass don't forget to subscribe. I'm Michael from Copper vs Glass with a quick look at Crossy Road and I will catch you guys in the next video.